Hello YouTube, this is John. In this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to enable USB boot options. And in my case, I'm going to show you how to enable the boot menu on your F12 key. So I'm going to power on the PC and I'll put my flash before I do anything. So when the PC goes on, I'm going to click F12 and I, uh, F12 may it not work at this moment, as you can see. We are booting, but nothing happens. So I'm going to switch off the laptop. But you can also click Control Alt Delete to restart. But in my case, I'm going to hold the button to force rest to force shut down it. Then I'm going to power on again. Then I'll click F2 so that we can go in the BIOS system. Then I power it on again. F2. Then we go to the BIOS system. So when you reach the BIOS system, this is what we get. Uh, we're going to go ahead and shift to the main part. Then I'm going to go ahead and enable this option. So we are having our F12, which is disabled, as you can see. So when we go to the F12, I'm going to click enter. Then we say enable. Then the next thing you're going to do, you're going to go to boot. And you have to make sure... Uh, legacy is enabled and you click OK. OK. Then after we are going to do something very simple. You're going to click F10 to save changes. Then the computer will restart. While the computer restarts, we are going to click F12. Uh, sorry about that. I was trying to... Uh, we're going to click F12. So when you click F12, uh, our computer will go to the boot menu. And this was just a quick video on how to enable USB boot options on your PC. So the next step here, you're going to just go ahead and click on USB, then click enter. Then the laptop will start loading Windows files. So I'm going to stop from here. Have a nice time. Goodbye. This was just a ESA laptop. And this is a touch screen. So we're going to stop from here. Have a nice time. Goodbye. Don't forget to subscribe.